Uh, greetings and salutations, my excellent friends. I hope that you are doing fantastic today. Today's question is concerning finding apartments here in Korea. Now, if you're coming to teach, you have some good news coming to you. And that is that most schools will provide you with housing. Unfortunately, you may not know what kind of housing you receive until you actually get here. My first apartment was, well, not exactly the best. It was kind of crappy. Uh, the ceiling was too small. And some of my other friends had apartments that were literally no larger than their bed. My other friends lucked out. They were given two and three bedrooms to enjoy during their year long here. So you never know. But as I said, most often you receive housing as part of your teaching contract. Other schools do not give you a place to stay. What they do is they will pay the deposit and the monthly rent or give you a stipend, stipend up to a certain one amount and will help you get your own housing. What is required though is a large deposit if you're going to pay rent. Now in Korea we have two systems for getting apartments. One is the old style in which you lay down a very, very, very large amount of money called key money. And that money is given to the owner and the interest of that is what is going to cover your, what we would consider monthly rent. That kind of system is going away because housing prices are going up astronomically. In Dongtan, I've heard of some apartments where the key money is upwards of 500 million won. That's roughly a half million dollars for a three bedroom apartment. It's outrageous. The other system and what people usually refer to as key money today is where you pay the deposit and then monthly rent on top of that. Now, back in the day, uh, an apartment would be maybe three or five million won, which is you know three to five thousand dollars, and then your monthly rent would be three hundred thousand or five hundred thousand a month. In my area, real estate's really going up, so things are a lot more expensive. Typical one room apartments are now five and 10 million won for key money. And then you're looking at five to 700,000 won a month for rent. Apartments, proper apartments are in the order of 100 million to 200 million and up. And as I said, if you're looking for a three bedroom, you could be looking at 500 million. If you're looking for uh, just a one bedroom apartment, you know, you could be looking at paying maybe 200 million won. It's, it's, it's crazy. And then uh, rent on top of that. It's nuts. It's nuts. So uh, what you do need, of course, is an alien registration card. You also need uh, some some kind of guarantee that you are working so that you can prove you have income coming in. And you just give that to the real estate agent and they'll take care of everything for you. There is a real estate fee, roughly about 10% of whatever the key money is. So you have to think about that as well. So I hope that answered the question. If you have a question for me, feel free to drop it down below, post a video response, or just ask. As always, thanks for watching. I will see you next time.